Hi there, everybody. It's Heather from Umpy Center for Teaching and Learning, and I want to take a couple minutes to walk you through how to use the headings to create more accessible content within Brightspace. So I am sitting here in one of my sandboxes, and I'm going to go into a content module because I want to create a new content page. And so I'm going to go to Upload Create because I'm creating new, but you can always go into Edit um, an already existing page as well. So I'm going to create a file. I'm going to give my file a name and I can see here that I have my content editor, which may be open or closed. You can see here that I have some styles formatting options right here. So I might have the title of my page that I want to set as a heading one. And then I might have some introductory text to put some more ripsum in. And then I may have a subtopic that goes with this page as well that I want to set at a heading two. content in there. And then if I have even further drilled down subcontent, I can go ahead and add heading three and so on. So that way the headings are always nested with the heading one being at the top followed by heading two and heading three is always under two, etc. So I hope this is helpful in helping you to create more accessible content on your Brightspace pages. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give Center for Teaching and Learning a call. Happy building!